How can using the old brake hardware ruin your next brake job? Well, we got laboratory data that proves it next. This video is sponsored by Carlson, manufacturer of disc and drum brake hardware, electric wear sensors, and brake lines. Visit carlsonqualitybrakeparts.com for more information. For your next brake job, you may be tempted to reuse the hardware that was originally on the vehicle. It may be the OE hardware. You may think this stuff is pretty good if the OE selected it. But if you don't replace it, you're gonna set yourself up for a noise comeback. In a recent laboratory study, three vehicles were tested for their first brake job. The mileages on these brake jobs vary between 45,000 and 35,000 miles. They took the original hardware off and they found some very interesting findings. When they actually looked at the physical hardware that came off the vehicle, well, they found out the dimensions were not the same as they were when they previously went on the vehicle when it was new. The shape has changed and the spring tension had changed too. So the hardware could not hold the pad properly in the bracket. The laboratory next, well, they put new brakes on the cars. And instead of using the original stainless hardware, they replaced it with some aftermarket hardware that had some unique features. First of all, it had a rubberized coating on the area that meets up with the caliper bracket. On the other side that met up with the brake pad, it had a special low friction coating that allowed the brake pad to move more easily. Once they got the new pads and hardware on the vehicle, well, they went on a drive and they found out that the new hardware, well, it reduced the noise by 47%. Also, they saw a 60% reduction in brake drag. By using a complete brake hardware kit and replacing the parts that really do need it, you are protecting your customer's investment in those new brake pads. These hardware sets have all the parts that can help prevent premature wear of the brake pads. This hardware, after I cleaned it up, well, it looks pretty good, but I know it does not meet the same specifications as the original hardware. And I also know that there are better options out there to make sure that the customer's brakes no longer make noise and have less drag. Changing the hardware is not just about the abutment clips. It's also about the pin boots, bolts, bleeder screws, guide pins, and also the bushings. And these are options that you have out there when you order a set of brake pads to order an additional set of hardware that has better options than the stuff that might be inside the box. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.